The Victorian Liberals have comprehensively won the by-election in the seat of Warrandyte, with candidate Nicole Werner set to be sworn in as soon as Tuesday. We're standing by to hear from her and leader John Pesuto. The result is comprehensive. More than 60% of the primary vote, well above the 2022 state election result. The result is already being viewed as a major boost to John Pesuto's leadership. And here he is talking right now. Daniel Andrews has turned his back on Warrandyte. He didn't even show up. And I tell you what, this is a vote to tell Daniel Andrews fairly and squarely that your time is up. Your time is up. Cost of living, budget blowouts, Daniel Andrews is sending Victoria broke and we are going to fix it because Daniel Andrews, you have ruined the state and we're going to repair it day by day, inch by inch, and we'll do it with people like Nicole Werner as the member for our night. So it's my pleasure right now to introduce to you the Leader of the Opposition, the future Premier of Victoria, and the worker for Warrandyte, Nicole Werner. to all of you. How good is tonight? Woo! I'm going to come to our fantastic candidate, Nicole Werner, and her husband, Fraser, in a moment. But I wanted to begin by thanking the people of Warrandyte tonight. Yeah. The people of Warrandyte have given us something very special. By placing their trust and confidence in Nicole Werner, to be their voice, their next voice, in the Victorian Parliament. Congratulations, Nicole. And I want to say to the people of Warrandyte, we will not let you down. We know how the Andrews government has let you down. We will not. We will work for you. We will fight for you. We will be your voice. And that will come in the form of Nicole Werner, who will join us in Parliament this week. Yeah. 
My dear Liberal friends, before I talk about what the significance of tonight really means, I want to pay tribute to Ryan Smith. Yeah. Ryan Smith was devoted to the community he served for so long in the Victorian Parliament, from 2006 up to this year. We all know how hard he worked because as we campaigned around this great seat over the last nine weeks, we heard about what a member of parliament he was, what a strong voice he was for the people. So to Ryan, if you're here tonight or if you're watching, can I thank you on behalf of the Liberal Party. Tonight, the people of Warrandyte have spoken for their fellow Victorians. They have said that they're tired of the corruption. They have said that they are tired of the incompetence. They have become tired of the branch stacking, the misuse of taxpayer dollars and the breach of faith with the Victorian people. That's what they've said tonight. We know, we know that the people of Warrandyte have been the voice of all Victorians tonight in saying that they are tired of the cost of living increases. They are tired of their jobs being taxed. They are tired of their rents being taxed. They are tired of their schools being taxed. They want to be heard. They want to be respected. They want to be looked after. And the people of Warrandyte have done their fellow Victorians a great service tonight because they have helped turn the tide in this state. 